Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. This is episode 31 of God of War. Here we are climbing up here. Oh no no no! Where's that guy? Okay. Yeah, let, let's do it. Let's do it this time. Let's finish this. <laughs> Show me more focus. Well, there it is. Watch our backs, boy. Best Jerry update. What was that? Fragmented Heart of Alfheim. Rare enhancement. Enchantment. Reduces all damage from Dark Elves attack by 12%. Stacks up to a 36 of max. Ancient. Heart. Oh, we did not use our rage. Oh, we did use our rage. Yeah, the last time when we had uh, to save 
Atreus. Let's not use these ones first. I hope we're not missing anything else. What is that? Light runic attack. A rapidly spinning melee attack that clears out surrounding arm uh, enemies and deals significant damage. That starts at 6. This is... We have fully improved this one to level 3. And... Oh no, level 3 will get it to that... Uh, I think we'll get it to that level. While this one... This is this is seven will become nine. This is six. If we upgrade it will become eight and become nine. What is this? This is the one that we have, right? Plus one frost, plus one stun. I think wow, but it requires 6,000 experience. This is the, this is our earliest one, right? This is primarily stun. And level two will increase two more stuns. And level three, so it, from five will become seven. So definitely we don't like that one. This one starts with 5 plus 2 with 7 plus 1 is 8. This one is currently at... Wow. No, th this one is... No, no. This is when it's fully fully upgraded. It becomes... Uh, right now it is... No, no, no. I, I'm, I'm getting all this all wrong. This is only level 1 and then it will have plus two to stun it becomes three becomes three becomes five this one will become five this one will become four will become nine this one will become seven and this one starts at uh no no becomes becomes six seven becomes seven so this is still the best one for us right wow but it takes six thousand experience points and we have not been using it that much How about this one? Uh, this one, yeah, that yellow thing is the additional damage in effect. I am reading this wrong. Okay, this one, fully max out, this becomes eight. Fully max out, this becomes, uh, this is currently six plus seven. Hmm. Wow, this, to max it out, it becomes uh, another 4,000. <sighs> How come we don't have... Yeah, we don't have anything for him. How about our skills? No, this one is while well, sprinting, press R2 to perform a massive leaping attack. Yeah, that is what we're trying to do. But I keep pressing R1 rather than that one. And this is... Uh, 
while evading hold L forward and press R1 to perform a quick axe attack. No, not, not very. While evading hold L back and press R1 for a quick boomerang throw. Not really interesting. Uh, perform attacks in quick succession without sustaining damage to power up. Oh, okay. And this one is increase the amount of permafrost gained on every successful axe hit. Uh, how about a shield? We have this. I tried to do this and it did not work. Uh, double tap L1. And this one, after a second after a last second block or parry, press R1 after a, a last second block to counter attack with a powerful shield strike. Blocking a projectile attack at the last second absorbs the impact and redirects the... Wow! But we have to have very good... Uh, Press R2 after a last second to counter the attack with a shield slam. Uh, oh, our rage. We have not looked at our rage. This is a simple attack, right? This is... In Spartan mode. This is Spartan mode. How about this? In Spartan rage, press R2 to jump into the air and slam down. What is this? Wow, 4,500. Perform a more powerful raging smash attack with a much wider area of effect. While this, R1 to deliver a forceful haymaker that knocks enemies backward at great speed. The problem is, if we knock them backwards, then they're away from our, from us, right? Press L1 to do a quick stomp that damages and disrupts all nearby enemies. Uh, that's kind of hard. Uh, so if we have this, and what is this one? In Spartan Rage, continue pressing R1 to extend the length of punches after a Fury Strike. What does that mean? One, two, oh, because real speed? I really like this one. And then what's the last one over here? In Spartan Press L3, uh, L2. Wow. Press L2 to pick up and hurl a large boulder from the ground that explodes on impact and deals massive damage. L2 rather than this, right? I think, I think I'll buy this. This is such a massive, although it uses, I presume it will use up a lot of rage too. Because there is a, uh, a, a slow down. I like this one because it has a mass attack and and we will use that primarily and then on the shield uh no on on the arrows oh these are all magical attacks and uh this is increased talents bow firing rate Yeah, let's buy this. What's this last one? Greatly increased house boys firing rate. Uh, 
uh, before we buy the next one. It's getting really expensive. Okay. Oh, no, let's. Look up there. That's another one. Oh, this is a rage one, and that's a heal. We're not missing. Look up there, up where? Okay, we are not missing anything, right? So we have a lot of heal here. Because once we, okay, one. So again, once we, I think we do that thing or we start hacking on that thing that is, that's here, right? We will get a lot of response time. Okay, let me, anyway, just again, uh, let me save this. That's a new save. back to the ring temple bridge wait did we open anything here also So the uh, dark elves are trying to shut this whole thing down then. I'll scout ahead. Huh. Guess the light makes more than bridges. Maybe this will spit us out on top. What does this do? I think this will bring us down. Or will it release those things? Here goes, here goes nothing. Oh, it brings us up. Oh, yeah, we're back here. That's where our boat is, right? Oh, but the water is gone. Can we go back down if we need to get to the uh, rage points? Oh, yeah, we can. You know... I will never get used to walking on solid light. The door. There's no seam. What? We have a problem. Oh. More of those bells. A Nornir chest must be nearby. Wait. That's one. That's a second bell. Where's the third bell? If we hit that one, then we have to hit that one. Or is it there a bell in here? Huh? 
Okay, there is the third one. If we hit that one, how do we do this? How do we position ourselves so that we can Too slow, too slow. Do we get it? No! Jeez. See, that's a long one. Too slow. Oh, we got it? We did! <laughs> and we got it on the way back. I mean, we missed it, but we got it on the way back. Woo! Talk about hand-eye coordination. Okay. <laughs> we did it. I don't care. As long as we did it. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Okay, is there anything else in here that was really, really... <laughs> I, I, I didn't realize we got it. And we got it on the rebound. 
Okay, this is one side. We just came in through here. What's on this other side? The dwarf again. Sindri? What? How is he here? Hey, Sindri, could you take a look at this? Honestly? I don't have much else going on right now. Whoa. You killed an ancient? Yes. Was it? Difficult? Yes. Is that all you're gonna give me? Yes. Labor completed. New recipe unlocked. How are you here before us, dwarf? We were told our path was the only one between realms. Well, it may be the only way for you to travel, but we dwarves are full of surprises. That is not an answer. Ah, hang on to that sense of wonder. There's so little mystery once you've amassed the wealth of arcane knowledge that I have. Where to comb the realms for exotic resources. How to craft them into creations that defy imagination. To the novice, I'm sure it all seems like magic, but... Uh, oh, all right. It is magic. It's magic. Are you happy now? Sindri, have you always been so... Clean? Huh. Don't I wish. No, I was just as unsanitary as the next dwarf until the day a Vanir witch set me straight. She discovered with her magic there are hundreds of thousands of tiny beasties on everything around us. Oh, so small you can't even see them. <laughs> it's true. And if they get inside you, they make you sick. But the witch told me there's one wood, the oak, that's a natural deterrent. Stops the beasties from spreading. So now, I make all my handles from oak. See? I think of these things. Okay, back to work. So how come Brock's blue and you're not? Boy. Oh, it's fine. Very good question, actually. You see, my brother's not as careful as I am. In fact, he prefers to work with metals using oh, his own bare hands. Oh, no gloves. Says it's the only way he can hear what it wants to be. Touch enough raw silver and it changes your skin irreparably. That means forever. I wouldn't bring it up to him, though. <laughs> you know how sensitive he can be. I guess that makes sense. Okay, let me cut the episode right here. Uh, thank you guys for joining me. I hope you will join me in the next episode. Bye.